today I'm going to tell you about my project on water cycle. The water cycle is a continuous movement of water within the earth and atmosphere. This project I submitted in my school's science fair. In this video, I'll show you how I made my project. The materials I used in this project is available everywhere. Let's start. Now I'm going to tell you the materials we used in this project. The materials we used are caulk sheet, cardboard, paint, glue. You may also need a printer to print the tags. Now I'm going to tell you how we made the ground. First we took an art paper and stick it to the ground. And then we took paint and colored the ground. Then we made the house by taking cardboard. We took different shapes of cardboard cut them and glued them to the house. The clouds we made by taking cock sheet with a pencil we drew the cloud shapes and then we took an anti cutter and cut it. We made the mountain by taking different pieces of cock sheet. We then glued the pieces of cock sheet and then brought the mountain shape by cutting with the anti cutter. There are lots of tags in this project. The tags we printed with a printer. There is also bridges and trees. The bridge we made with cardboard and then we painted the bridge. The trees are also made with cardboard but we use paint to make it green. There is a large river on this project. The river we painted with paint on the art paper. There is a road. The road we took ochre paint and colored. There is snow above the mountain. The snow we took cock sheet and cut it and sticked it to the mountain. For the sky, we took an art paper and cut a large piece out of it. Then we drew the sky on the art paper and we painted it. After that, we took a cock sheet and cut a large piece out and then we took the art paper that was colored and stick it to the cock sheet. Now I'm going to tell you a little about water cycle. The water cycle is the continuous movement of water within the earth and atmosphere. Water cycle is a complex system that includes many different processes. Liquid water evaporates into water vapor, condenses to form clouds and back to earth's surface in the form of rain, fog and snow. Water in different phases moves through the atmosphere that's called transportation. Liquid water flows across the land and infiltration into the ground. Plant uptake the water from the ground and evaporates into the atmosphere. River water, sea water, solid ice and snow can turn directly into gas. This process is called sublimation. The opposite can also take place when water vapor becomes solid. This process is called deposition. That's all I will say to you about water cycle. How was my project? You can also make this project by following the steps I showed in this video. Also, how was the video? If you like this video, please give like on this video and subscribe to our channel to stay with us for getting notifications about your future projects.